Hello my brother and sister all around the world. This is Okana speaking to you. Welcome to Okana Frappuccino. So y'all get your lovely drink right here. Mm -hmm. But the first topic of, <laughs> of 2023. As we reported, former Trump Organization CFO Alan Weisselberg pleaded guilty today to tax fraud. Alan Weisselberg pleaded guilty to 15 counts and acknowledged he failed to pay taxes on $1.7 million of income. Alan Weisselberg entered guilty pleas to 15 counts of tax fraud and related charges. Uh, according to prosecutors, Alan Weisselberg was uh, receiving un uh, corporate benefits, including uh, company apartments. for two of his grandchildren and a pair of Mercedes Benz. But did you know the FBI and the IRS are looking for you, sir? You be like, honey. Honey, okay, we need to go. We, we need to go. Why? No, we, we need to go right now. But no, 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 honey, we need to go. Okay, we look, listen, I work for Trump for this long. We need to go. We need to pack your bag, pack, pack everything. We're going to sell, sell, sell everything. Sell the house, sell, sell the car, sell, sell the, okay. Okay, kids, come on. We got to go. We got to go. We got to leave. Okay, look, honey, please, we got to go now. We got to leave. They're going to be here. You don't understand. Okay, I'm sorry I lied to you, but we got to go. I, this motherfucker is psychotic. Probably the only one who will tolerate your smug ass. You're the motherfucking improper influence. Get your shit. Get your shit and get out. Never once ever show his taxes. Now I know Fox News are going to say he showed his taxes, y'all. He showed his taxes. Biden never showed his taxes. Dean, but if he hasn't done anything illegal, I am disturbed by the fact that this was leaked. Apparently, we're from all the way from 25 to 35 years ago. So that was a long time ago. We find about Nancy Pelosi's companies. Why don't we find about Elijah Cummings' companies? Maxine Waters seems to be worth a lot of money suddenly. But Trump. <laughs> Take a look at Trump. This is calculated, deliberate, premeditated misconduct, followed by a cover-up that included false statements and lies to Congress, the media, and the American people. Forget about what was on the emails. It's irrelevant. All of that. What in God's name was you doing? All that. Done? What have you been hiding? Oh. So what does this oh, mean? Does this mean I literally just bought Ratatouille for nothing? Cancelled its public sale for Taylor Swift's upcoming tour. Masters facing mounting scrutiny here after millions of fans waited hours only to run into glitches and error messages on the website. I feel so bad for y'all because you paid for that ticket to so see Taylor Swift? And this is what they do to you? <gasps> First, there was the anticipation. But when the queue opened up to finally buy tickets for Taylor Swift's upcoming stadium tour, oh, no, for fans, the Swifties went from freaking out Are you joking? What? <laughs> to melting down. The tickets you have selected have been released. Ah! The line has stopped moving. The website fully crashed. They waited in line for like six hours. So upset right now because I was in line for Taylor Swift tickets. As more fans lost out on tickets, they started looking for someone or something to blame. This was a terrible experience. I'm really disappointed. And a lot of them looked at Ticketmaster. All of these things were preventable. What is wrong with? Do you not realize who you're dealing with? Taylor Swift. You're dealing with the most popular female artist of all time have sold over 200 million records globally. Swift is one of the best-selling musicians in history. She's the most streamed woman on Spotify. Spotify. Lemma Grammys. Three albums of the year. You need to shut the fuck up. 
Up. 29 Billboard Music Award, 92 Guinness World Record, 92. Shut the fuck up. And she is featured on the Rolling Stone 100 Greatest Songwriter of All Time. You have screw it, Ticketmaster. So this is what we're gonna do, Ticketmaster. This is what I want need you to do. You are never gonna do this to any other performer. You are not gonna do it to Lizzo concert. You ain't gonna do it to Justin Bieber concert. You ain't gonna do the Ed Sheeran concert. You, you better not do the BT. Uh, well, okay. You know what, BTS is kind of on the break, but you better not do the BTS. You better not do the Blackpink. How do you like that? Blackpink in the area. All right, y'all, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed the video and hope you learned something from this topic, y'all, because. Huh. It's something. I'll see you next week, guys. And don't forget, Wakanda forever. <laughs>